everyone, so here is my house tour. My house is currently not finished, but I thought I'd give you guys a tour anyway. So let's just get straight into my house tour then. So as you can see, it's still currently like winter and I'm keeping it that way because this house was built in winter and I wanna embrace the winter as much as I can. And then over here we've got some lovely sheep, which are not mine. I got them from a wonderful, talented creator here on YouTube. I've linked them in the description. You should totally go and check out their farm animal hacks video and that's where I got the sheep from because loads of places like these kind of cottages you get here in Scotland I often find, which is what the inspo of this was, like they have like farm animals and stuff. Right, so heading into the actual house, this is like the mudroom area. Is that what they call it? I don't know. Front entrance in it. You put all your, your shoes. And over here we've got the lovely kitchen, which is actually inspired by a cottage I went to earlier this year. And they had like the kitchen right here. And you could look out the window while doing the dishes. And it was just, oh, it was just absolutely beautiful. The scenery, it was just one of the most beautiful cottages I'd ever been in before. Over here is the laundry area. Pretty self-expansion, isn't it? It's a laundry area. It's quite modern, actually. The countertop thing's actually quite modern, especially for this, like, cottage. But I think it looks really cute. I like the size of it and everything. Very cute, compact. Very nice. And then over here, we have the downstairs bathroom, which is the only bathroom that I have at the moment that has a bathtub in it, and I love the bathtub because it's pink, but it's not really that finished because I need to like add more to it I think like you can see it's missing a mirror and stuff so it's a work in progress and then over here oh, <laughs> ignore these like cinematic shots I don't know I thought I like ate with them and stuff but we're keeping them in either or yeah there's my shrine next to the dining table and then yes yeah, so there's a dining table really cute very spacious this was all green before if you saw the original house it was green what are these shots it looks like a hotel like advertisement sorry i'm keeping them in though i don't care anyways yeah it was all green before and i've made it all white now and, you know i had to do a lot of stuff for it anyway i don't know what i'm saying here's the um piano i love the piano it's act it is playable as you can see it's like a piano i shoved in the wall and then did a bunch of custom content in around it and then i've got a big shelf this is like the other seating area which we don't want to talk about because it's the back of the house and it's unfinished and ugly and it's bleh. So ignore that. Here's my like magnum opus, my living room. I absolutely adore this. Oh my goodness. Even when it was green, I saw it looked gorgeous. I mean, it was such a beautiful green. I used it in like, uh, like the Christmas tree at the window and everything. The like sitting area where the window is now is new. That's where the Christmas tree used to be because I wasn't really sure what to put there. And the fire, as you can see, oh my goodness, it is a fire. I've just put stuff around it, if that makes sense, a bunch of basic shapes. And then, like, you know, storage, shelving, great stuff. And those are photos as well. I was going to make a collage on my wall at some point of, like, you know, photos from, like, Boxburg parties and stuff. Anyways, up here we have the, well, my room, the, like, bathroom. There's not much to it, isn't it? It's just a bathroom in it. It's got like bathroom stuff. I don't know, it's got a toilet. That's it. But here's the the best part of the whole house, and that is my bedroom. As you can see, it's absolutely gorgeous. I love the bed, and I know you guys love it too. You've all been sitting saying how much you love the bed, and yeah, that's I love it. And here's a little teddy bear. <laughs> just so cute. And then yeah, my both my nightstands that I've put like a diary and stuff on one side and other stuff. And there's some posters, you know, just to remind you how cool I am. And then here's my collage. Of, if I could, I would have this in real life. Just all the posters on the wall. I absolutely adore it. Like I love the big ones that go up the wall and stuff. My big Nebworth poster. I think that's so cool. <laughs> And then yeah, there's my like vanity, and I love the. I did this like hack. Basically, you put like a Polaroid on a square, and you like. Can you use a transform tool and you like push it into the mirror and it looks like you've stuck polaroids on the mirror and i think it looks really cute but again it's the same images me recycling images and yeah and there's my camera that i put on a little tripod i thought it was so cute i love the whole makeup area and then yeah there's the ginormous record player that we don't talk about and then there's another sitting area which again is super cute look how cozy that is oh i love it and yeah that's my room pretty much that's my house but yeah, that's my house, so thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed. Um, 
yeah, like I said, just to go to sleep, there are, there, well, there is another bedroom, but it's not finished, so I just didn't bother showing that, it's got like a hoover in it, you know, and that's about it, so there was no point showing that, and then there is actually a back garden, but again, there's like holes in the floor, so I was like, yeah, I'm not going to show that, but I still wanted to get the house tour anyway, because I just really wanted to share it with you guys my new home where the new vlogs will be getting filmed which is just lovely and no there's not going to be a speed build of it before you ask no because i don't want to rebuild that <laughs> sorry a bit lazy but you know it's just it was hell to build and it's i don't want to go through it again but i love it very much and yes so hope you enjoyed the tour more vlogs will be coming if you could let me know vlogs you would like let me know because um, I need some ideas, so if you've got ideas, let me know. And yeah, I think that's like it. So thank you and goodbye, and have a lovely day.